Yo bro, this is Louis aka the Text God and today I'm really excited because I'm gonna give you one little trick for your Bumble bio that will automatically make all your conversations better. First of all, if you think about it, what makes for a good Bumble bio? Well, actually it's the same than for all other dating apps except there's one tiny difference. And this tiny difference is actually not tiny at all, it's massive. Um, for example, you're on Tinder or you're on Badoo or I don't know any dating app and you want to create a good bio What does a good bio need to do? Well, I think it needs to show character. It needs to have her check out your whole profile. It needs to... Hey, meatballs! Hey, meatballs! <laughs> anyway, so it needs to... Uh, sh show character it needs to convince her to check out your whole profile or ideally convince her to like you on tinder that would be a swipe right on other apps they will just have to smash a button um, it needs to do a whole lot of things but on bumble there's one extra thing and this is so crucial by the way if you want to know how good your bio currently is or your whole profile is i made a free checklist for any app that we have for any dating app you can download it in the link down below the video and it's a profile checklist that you can compare to your current profile and it will give you an idea of how good you're currently doing and how much better you could do anyway the giant difference with a bumble bio is that on bumble if you have a match with a girl you can't send an opener you're actually absolutely powerless until she sends you a message first and she only has 24 hours to do this if she doesn't text you within 24 hours the match is gone forever there are some special functions where you can give her a little bit more time and stuff which actually makes you just super desperate um, l let's talk about that in another video but if she doesn't open you you're screwed there's nothing you can do so what will girls do on bumble will they send the very funniest witty charming openers hmm will they send the best lines they found on textgod.com hmm Will they thoroughly analyze your profile, look at all your pictures, read your bio and then come up with a personalized opener that just blows your mind and you're so compelled that you have to respond? <sighs> no, no they won't. What will happen is this, either they just really don't know what to say and they end up sending an opener which ends your match, the match will just disappear so you have nothing, back to, back to start or they will not know what to say and of course this is not gonna happen all the times but most of the times they won't know what to say and they'll just end up saying hi or hey how's your date going something super generic like this so this is where bumble is different from other apps and here comes your solution to this problem what you're gonna do is you're gonna add a call to action as they say in marketing to your bio so what this is you're gonna give her something that makes it really easy for her to send you the first message and this message is not gonna be high it's actually gonna be something interesting that automatically gets your conversation going in a very exciting fun way so let's just look at an example and it's an example by my good friend and coach at textgod.com popping up on your screen right now just kidding right now well this is the screen you see when you're editing your profile so this seems pretty simple right and you're correct it is pretty simple but there's a reason why it is pretty simple who do you know that doesn't like food or even even better who do you know that doesn't like at least one particular type of food almost no one so the target audience of this opener is super broad almost every girl on bumble has a favorite type of food so this makes a threshold for opening this guy super low besides it's better food is more sensual it's not super sensual but it's more sensual than just hi or uh, how's your day going so that's another plus how about we just look at an example of how this opener is put into work appearing on your screen three two one <laughs> this girl says carbonara all day every day until i die to which my friend replies i love you in the hat be my post brexit refugee wife sarah i'll take you in and feed you carbonara for life she replies I love this conversation already. We have to be specific though about carbonara styles because there are many. Talk carbonara to me, Sarah. <laughs> I love how he's almost saying nothing. <laughs> well, firstly, I hope you don't use cream because that's a big no-no. Talk more sauce. Well, come on down, that's my coach's name. It's Egg Pecorino and Love. So just look at this conversation. It's so silly, but how would you ever have a conversation that starts so effortlessly, so 
easily with so much fun vibes and even emotion if it would have started with just the high and the best part is he did basically nothing the the bio worked for him she opens and he's just shouting random things if you want to learn how to shout random things that make her feel all sorts of positive emotions subscribe to the channel because I'll, I'll teach you for a couple bucks use this opener if you want to or just use the principle you can slightly tweak this opener to make it more authentic more personal to you but you can just also copy the principle if you would like to see more examples or more bios you can just steal check out the article linked down below the video in the description box and of course like the video to show some love because I'm a very sensitive boy and uh, subscribe because if you don't justice shall be served. I'm actually in front of the Palace of Justice here in Ghent in Belgium. Uh, this is where your trial will be if you don't subscribe. <laughs>